guys, it's me again, uh, MJL from the Lollipop 211 team, and I'm back with another Sweets and Treats doll candy video, but first I have to tell you how I do the video cut off on my last, last one, uh, my last candy, something, Sweet Treats video, and I did get to show you how to make one of these. So all you do is cut out a section and then you fold up the sides and you trim off, trim off the end. And it makes like a closed thing. You just want to make sure you fold it in a lot so it creases. And then once you cut off the extras, you get like little circles like these. And you can use this as like little mints or something like that. Right now we're going to be making like Smarties for, um, no, oh, I was just looking at something. Smarties for a uh, American Girl doll or La Loopsie, or like candies individually wrapped. So what you'll need are some beads, like I just picked two of each color that I have. Well, not actually all that I have. I found this one. And I get like, how many, like two for each package. So, two little rubber bands that you can get for like 50 cents for 300 or 600 of them. And you'll need this plastic wrap from a sandwich bag. And also scissors. And if it doesn't work out, glue. So what you want to do is, you're going to start out, let me move this out of the way a little. You're going to start out by cutting this open on the crease. Like so, it's like you don't have to be exact, but looks better if you cut it open on the crease. So you're just going to cut through to make it one big hole. Okay, so Now you got this big thing here. And what I'm going to do, since my bag is like, it's attached there, I'm just going to cut this like right here. So then it can flip up, but I need to... There we go. So now I have this big sheet of plastic, which... I can use now easier. So what you're gonna do is um, you if it you want like individually wrapped, just put one on. But I'm gonna measure like how much I want to cut. So I'm gonna cut like about like right here, just to give it some space to fold over and stuff like that. So you're gonna cut down like into the middle, like right to the middle. Or you can cut down all the ways, and then you can get two out of that, so. Now, guys, if you have a different idea of how to do stuff, then please feel free to do it. I'm not saying you have to do it this way. Just my idea of things. Okay. So make sure there's no paper stuck on it like there is on mine. And, yeah. So... You can either put in some little peppermint bits or candy bits in here, or you could put this, these little beads in here. So what you're going to do is you can, I would rather glue them together, like with a glue stick. And so if you want to take them apart, you can, because it's a, it's a washable glue stick, so it's, not like it's going to be permanent, but just so it's easier to put on. Although it's very hard to um, make them stick on, but you can always make it work. Sorry, is that that? Glue? Cool. 
Yeah, it's not going to work very well for me. So, what I'm going to do is I'm going to... I'm going to use my common sense. I'm going to put a coffee straw on them. Stick them through it. Like this. Then you're going to place it on your cut it, cut it, cut out wrapper. Okay, and then you're just going to wrap it up. Okay, take out the straw. Twist the one end around, like so it stays in place, and secure it with a rubber band. First, I'm going to cut this off. It's a little easier to do. Now you're just going to take this end and secure it with a rubber band. I mean, it's going to be hard because um they might fall out the other end. But it still is possible. I mean, just try your best and hope it works. Now, if they fall out, that's okay. You're going to... Mine fell out, so I'm going to rewrap it. Right on this end. And then I'm going to twist it on the other end, which will be way easier to tie because the other one isn't open. Now, if you just want them for decoration, hot glue them together. It'll be way easier, and, yeah. But if you want them to be able to be opened and removed individually, then don't glue them. Just do what I did. And just keep tying these. I'm going to tie more on this one because I didn't get to it much. And then you can trim off any extra like here. I'm going to trim off some of it. And there you go. You got your candy. So you can do this with beads or foam with a hole punch and glue them all together, which I should try to do. Or you could do it with these little, um, uh, oh man, peppermint bites that I showed you on the last one. So I'm going to try it with a peppermint bite to show you how it will be done. So what you're going to do is you're going to cut out a little strip, like a little thing like this, or enough that it can, yeah, be on there. You're just gonna, going to wrap it up. And you're going to get your glue stick, glue the end part, oops, Make sure your thing doesn't come out. That's good. Okay. You can glue this end part together and carefully, like, roll it up. Twist the end. To keep it in there. And if you want, you can glue them. I will probably end up doing. I 
make sure your glue dries clear first before doing so. Because it won't look very nice with white glue outside of it. Mine is blue, but then it dries it clear. Okay. And you just trim it. And you got a little individual piece. This looks so cute. So you could use this for any dolls. It goes the same for bigger lollipop dolls to smaller ones. I mean, it you could just do a candy show and stuff like that. So I hope this helped, and I hope you take this tutorial to your advantage on your shows, uh, tutorials, anything that you do on YouTube, or if you're just playing at home. So yeah. I hope you liked this video, and comment if you want more of these, or if you have an idea on what we should do, um, and what we should do with some other things, like, I don't know, anything. <laughs> um, we'll find a way to do stuff with things, as long as we have it, so we can show you, but, yeah, that's all. Oh, by the way, I made another lollipop. It's a peppermint one. Yeah. So I hope you keep guys keep uh, crafting. And I'll see you soon. So, yeah. Bye.